welcome back to my channel this is auntie z your chief cheerleader at shape of african encouraging you and me to live a healthy lifestyle from our african heritage foods welcome to my cooking class if you're new here make sure that you hit that subscribe button and join the super family come on now join the super family also don't forget to hit the notification bell below so that you get super vip treatment and get notified every time i post a new recipe in today's cooking class guys we continue with our summer salad i've already shown you guys how to make my sumptuous chicken salad which you can check by clicking this link right over here and we've also made a very delicious egg salad last week oh my goodness that was absolutely delicious so make sure you check those recipes click the link right over here or go to my videos to watch all the deliciousness that I've been posting over the last couple of weeks today's recipe guys is an absolutely delicious salmon and papillot on arugula salad guys don't worry about the French going on in there. En papillot just simply means in parchment paper, okay? And I'm going to show you how to make this absolutely delicious summer salad in just a minute. Listen guys, this salad is choked full with all the absolutely good for you ingredients like salmon and avocado that contain good for you heart healthy omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids. And we're going to be upgrading this recipe with some black pepper, which is absolutely delicious. We're going to add in some lime and lemon juice to freshen things up a little bit. And we're going to add some much needed red hot chili peppers into this dish as well all of this deliciousness guys is going to be served on a bed of arugula salad which is a salad that is distinct in taste guys it absolutely complements this recipe all right guys let's get right into the cooking process okay guys we're going to start off by slicing our onions into really thin slices we're going to be using half of the onion on the salmon that goes into the oven and the other half we're going to use it when the salmon is cooked just so that we can have some fresh crunchy onions when the salmon um, has been grilled in the oven okay so go ahead and slice that into very very thin slices just like so and this is just going to go right into our bowl Next up is our lemon, guys. We want to just go ahead and roll this a little bit so that it can soften, okay? So that we get all of that juice out of the lemon. We're going to just go ahead and cut this into two and set it aside. We'll do the same thing with the lime. Get it into two and set it aside. This is just the preparatory work for the salmon or papillot. Next, we have our two garlic cloves here, which I'm going to crush, and this is a trick. Just like that, you see? I'm going to go ahead and remove that peel. And the other one. We set this aside as well. Up next are our chili peppers. You can leave them whole like this, or if you want it hot, what you can actually do is just take a knife and slice it open like so. So that when the juices get into the pepper, it's going to really make it hot. Okay, I'm just going to do two, and we're going to set this aside. So we just want to make sure that we prepare all our ingredients so that we don't come back to chopping anything, okay? So right here, I have my avocado, and I'm going to go ahead and cut it into two just like so once the seed is out guys i'm going to slice my avocados into really large chunks like so okay i'm not going to make it small i'm going to slice it like that and then i'm going to use a spoon to scoop that avocado out oh my yum this looks and feels so buttery and i cannot wait okay guys Let's set this aside. Now it's time to marinate the salmon pieces, okay? Go ahead and line um, an oven tray with parchment paper like this. And then you want to get another roll of parchment paper just like this one. And you want to make it a long or large roll. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and set this aside. 
and this is where our salmon is going to go into that is why it is called un papillot so it's like papier you know like paper okay it's inside a parchment paper that we're going to cook this salmon so first of all what I'm going to do is I'm going to line my salmon on the parchment paper like so and notice that I like to keep the skin on just like this because I just have the feeling that the taste is taken to another level when the skin is left on so I'm going to start off by just putting in my garlics just close to the salmon like so next I'm going to put in my chilies I want to make it really hot so <laughs> If you don't like it really hot you can leave the chilies out this is totally optional then I'm going to sprinkle some salt not so much some crushed black pepper now be generous with your spices okay we want to really make this tasty and also remember that the salad dressing is going to come from the drippings of the salmon okay so make sure that you're generous with the spices now in goes our onions right there spice that all up I love onions and I think you can tell already <laughs> right <laughs> next the juice of half a lemon and the juice of half a lime as well So what I like to do is I just incorporate that piece of lime inside there. And last but not least, a generous amount of olive oil. Look at that. So guys, once all of that is done, now we're going to just wrap this all up in this sheet of paper so that we sort of steam and grill the fish at the same time but also making sure that we have lots and lots of juice inside there because we're going to use the drippings for the salad all right now we're going to wrap this all up and this is what the French say on papillot okay we're going to wrap this all up like so bring this other end together put this in put this in and wrap it all up put this other end in put this end in and wrap it all up just like so great so all of this is going to the oven and we're going to bake it at a really high heat so that it browns really and gets really crispy and also we have all of that juice going on inside there we're going to go ahead and bake this for about 25 minutes at 200 degrees celsius okay guys our salmon our papillot is ready and i'm going to go ahead and show you what it looks like on the inside first of all the order is really to die for look at this oh my goodness oh my goodness this looks absolutely delicious smells absolutely amazing so there you go see all of that juice all around there this is what we're going to use for the dressing so let's go ahead and set the salad up all right guys what we're going to do is we're first of all going to try to collect all of that juice for our salad and here you have our a regular salad so we want to already pour in the juice inside here so that all of the juice and the dressing so to say should already be on the salad so guys what I'm going to try to do now is to get this sauce which we are going to use as the dressing into our aragula bowl we're going to get this and we're going to pour it all in there then we're going to go ahead and give this a gentle mix look at that so it's time to serve this baby up first off we're going to start by adding in our arugula salad in there just like so oh my goodness this looks so yummy and i cannot wait <laughs> i can never wait i'm always too eager to start digging in who wouldn't it's such a sumptuous plate of salad going to go ahead and add in our salmon oh my goodness add in some grilled onions right there and don't be afraid to even add in the garlic okay it has been really very well cooked you can 
bite that it's really healthy and delicious so in goes some of our chili peppers right there in goes some fresh onions my 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 this is looking absolutely amazing don't you think now we're going to go ahead and just sprinkle some more juice oh my goodness this is one salad that you should definitely make might want to give this a little bit more of a sprinkle of black pepper and then last but certainly not least we're just going to go ahead and garnish this yum now let's go ahead and give this a taste test mm. Mm, 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 mm. This is extremely flavorful. Oh my goodness, the arugula salad has a distinct peppery taste which combines so well with the citrus fruits like the lemon and the lime that I mix all in there. And then that little bit of heat from the scotch bonnet pepper is absolutely amazing. It just goes really well to combine the black pepper and the garlic absolutely amazing guys and a must make there you are super family if you love this video make sure you give me two thumbs up comment below let me know what recipes you want me to plan for the com for the coming months of september and october and also let me know if you have tried out this summer salad that i've been showing you during the past couple of weeks also do not forget to hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell so you are always informed when i post a recipe and do not forget to share invite your friends share this video and like it means so much to me guys i'm going to see you in my next one bye